My story starts here, then goes here. I grew up in Brazil, and no, not in the jungle. I'm more of a city kid. Então, eu falo português. My mom is Brazilian, and my dad is American. Two other important people in my life were born in Brazil, my little bro and sis. I found it interesting growing up in such drastically different cultures. Brazilian culture is very touchy and close, while Americans are pretty cold and seem to have a natural bubble around them. I was very used to Brazilian culture for the first five years of my life. Then I moved to the U.S., Pittsburgh to be specific, and culture was quite different. Throughout elementary school, I experienced the culture of the personal bubble, and I became quite a reserved kid. During those years, I would draw often, and a passion for art began to stew inside of me. When I turned 10, we moved back to Brazil. Those years were so great. I discovered what I wanted to do with my life in terms of work and such. In sixth grade, my friends, Rods, Logan, and I started making videos together. We called ourselves R.I.L. Studios. We started making videos for school projects and for fun to show off to the class. I jumped into visual effects and eventually 3D computer animation. My lifetime goal is now to form an animation company, and that is still a goal of mine today. I was pulled away from my friends and the beauty of Brazil for high school. Now that I had set goals, I began reaching out to pursue them. In high school, I took several classes in computer graphics and began making my own animations for fun. I also grew in my love for learning. I had some excellent teachers and began pursuing a variety of fields. I pursued music. I learned guitar and joined the school choir. I delved into math and science, particularly physics. I had a lot of fun working on personal projects outside of school. I grew deeper in my understanding of existence. I developed my belief that there is no purchasing life after death, but rather that life has been purchased because God reached down to us through Jesus Christ. Toward the end of my high school career, I began to see my need for a deeper understanding of software, especially if I planned on creating an animation company. I decided to go to Virginia Tech to further my knowledge in computer science and to develop tools for artists, including myself. I pursue animation with the hope of sharing with others the truths that I believe in. I always pursue excellence in my art, and that excellence includes a foundational understanding of the tools I use. I desire to build and test my own tools through art, aiding artists in my work. I am Ian Jelliff, and I am a half-Brazilian, knowledge-seeking, Christian, musical, artistic engineer. And this is what one engineer looks like.